everybody, how are you? Welcome to Monday, um, where it is glorious and sunny. It's like 20 degrees, I um, don't know which way is up because of the weather. I've got a coat on, I've got a jumper on, I'm sweating. Um, but yeah, God, well, I've just spent the day, it's four o'clock now, I've spent the day shooting and working. So I just had loads of projects on, which has been so amazing and fun. So I've been working with a photographer to get all of that done. We just finished and now I'm just going to tidy up because oh my god, <laughs> there's crap everywhere. Bedroom's the worst. It's out of control. Um, oh, you don't even want to see this. I can't with that around there. That's no. Um, and yeah, thanks for being patient with me on my last vlog last week. It took me literally a whole week to upload it my computer ran out of storage and i couldn't seem to figure all of that out so i've done it now and hopefully it will be plain sailing by now but actually it was really nice to have a week off i've been feeling like really good and everything recently and like really balanced and stuff and you've all been so kind and like noticing that i am really good at the moment which is just so lovely and it keeps happening in my r real life as well like in everyday life when i see people they're like oh you're looking so well and like you seem so happy and i'm like i am like i don't know what's going on but i've not felt this happy before um and then as is life last week when i didn't vlog well there was a dark cloud over me for a full week well i'd say about five of the seven days it was so hard to shift didn't know what why it was there. There was no rhyme or reason. I mean, I say no rhyme or reason, like nothing dramatic was happening, but I actually think I'd maybe burnt the candle at both ends, like with fashion week and going out so much and socialising so much. And I'd probably drank three, four times that week, whereas that's not normally me because alcohol doesn't really agree with me. Um, it always makes me feel really blue when, I, when I've had a drink after, like the days after. So I think maybe that's got a part to play in it, but yeah, I just could not shake it. I just could not shake it. Um, but please report that I am feeling much brighter again this week. And me and Kim are going to Paris for fashion week in a couple of days. So you can come to Paris with us. Um, and so, yeah, I just needed to get all my work done today, get on top of everything. I've got loads to sort out for Marnie Rays. We, we're gonna announce new destinations, new dates for all of next summer really soon. So I want you all to be the first to know about that. So I'm gonna put a little sign up to the wait list to join the wait list so you can be the first. The washer. Um, so you can be the first to find out when the new destinations will launch and all of the wellness offerings that we've got to go along with it all because it's going to be so exciting and I'm so excited um and yeah just getting on top of everything really sorry getting on top of everything I just need to plan my, my looks for Paris because it's going to be really nice weather there as well and there's not going to be no rain and it's just going to be so nice and bright and I just love Paris so much and can't wait to be there I've not been for ages and ages um so yeah just getting organised, but I'm going to go to, I'm going to have a protein shake, go to the gym, go to the shop, get some food to cook for my tea, and then I'm going to have a night in and just watch TV on my sofa that I'm still very obsessed with. So that is me, guys. Um, I hope you're all really good and that you're having a nice day and stuff. I've got quite a bit of makeup on for me, but I have just been doing some, um, uh, like, testing stuff out for Merit. So the lip jelly and their amazing new eyeshadows and I always use their highlighter which you can see here um they're just so good and I'll link the products for you because they are bloody brilliant um that's it I think Did anything else happen in the meantime of like last week that I need to catch you up on no just a dark cloud and everything else is really good and yeah i'm gonna protein shake and gym and i'll see you in a bit or tomorrow maybe hi guys it's tuesday <laughs> it's half four again before i've even come to speak to you because it's been mental i'm sweating what's the weather doing i don't know but it's very very hot um been to the gym i've been to work with the team all day um had a meeting I'm out of breath, <laughs> just run up and down the stairs. And um, this is what we're dealing with. 
I'm packing for Paris. <laughs> So I go tomorrow, fashion week, and so far I need six outfits and I've got one. And I've got 30 minutes before my next sleep hypnotherapy session. So I really want to have it done before then so I can really relax into the hypnosis session. Um, I've got my big suitcase stored at Lizzie's because I've got no storage here. So that's on the way as well. I've got a collection happening in a minute. It's all going on. Um, so it all feels a bit chaotic. And also the weather in Paris is gonna be like 26, 27 degrees all week that I'm there, which is so amazing. But also I just packed my summer clothes away. I'm gonna forget them all that again. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying outfits on and I'll show you everything as I go along because I simply don't have time right now. But yeah, I'm gonna take some of my favorite pieces along with me um, and just put them together in a really weird way because that's what you do at fashion week. I was saying to Kim before who I'm going with, you know, Kim, I was like, mate, it doesn't matter. Don't stress. Like all fashion week is, is putting things together that don't go together and making them look cool. <laughs> she was like, oh no. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, we've had a laugh about that. Um, and to an extent it is true. You've just got to push boundaries during fashion week. I feel like it's like real playing dress up. Um, so I'm very happy with my first look, which I'll show you when I get there because I look a bugger right now and none of it's ironed. So yeah, I'm just flapping, might be the, the right word. Uh, but yeah, I hope you're all really well. This is chaos. I'll speak to you later probably after I've calmed down after the hypnotherapy. Um, and I'll take a breath between now and then. <laughs> Good morning everybody from me and my hair <laughs> it's nine o'clock in the morning and i'm just i had a really big lovely sleep actually which i really needed but i did wake up with a spot so <sighs> swings and roundabouts isn't it um i'm just taking my vitamins i usually take some iron and a multivitamin for women and also my probiotic from the you're looking well skincare um, brand that I talked to you about in last week's vlog, which I'm really impressed with. I think I've got about another week of these to go, but my stomach's been really good, you know. Um, so it's been, yeah, way more settled. And the only change that I've made is the probiotics. So I'm very, very happy about that. Um, what to tell you? I'm packed. I'm packed for Paris. Here we are. We're all ready many 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 cosmetics lizzie always says that's my downfall that's how i'm the heaviest ever whenever whenever we travel <coughs> excuse me so i'm getting the train so nobody can stop me now <laughs> nobody can stop me with my weight um what else i'm just waiting kim has done a last minute matches order to my house because she's in ireland so that's coming this morning so i'll pack that for her and then we get to Paris at about six o'clock tonight. We're staying in a really lovely hotel that we found last minute, which has cost us. I can't even think about it, but I'm like, do you know what? Life experience, it's fine. <laughs> and at least we're sharing it. So yeah, um, I need to like put another coat of, coat of paint on my toes. And um, oh, guys, I'm going to meet Hayley Bieber this week. I, I, d I don't, I, I can't. So I've got a few outfit options for when I meet her because what am I, what am I going to wear? Um, I think, is it tomorrow? It's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. I'm meeting her tomorrow. We're going for dinner. Just me and her. No. <laughs> it's to celebrate um, the, new, the new road makeup, foray into makeup. They've got some um, coloured tints, lip peptide tints now, which I can't wait to try. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go for dinner to celebrate that and Hayley Bieber's going to be there. So I'm going to need a stiff drink before I do that because I'm going to be really nervous because I really like her. <laughs> um, what else? Yeah, we've just got such a nice week coming up. It's going to be so good. 
And the weather in Paris, I think I said yesterday, is going to be so gorgeous, so we're very, very lucky, but it's made it really hard to get dressed because I've really transitioned into autumn-ish, and now I've got like to wear shorts and tanks and flats and boots, so yeah, I've just tried to make it fashion. So we'll see. Anyway, I'll show you every day what I'm wearing, um, and yeah, can't wait. Cannot wait. Um, I'm just going to sit here and mess about for a bit. And I think I'm going to journal actually this morning. Sometimes it really helps and I get a really overwhelming urge to journal to get things out of my head. So this morning is one of those times I think. It feels like I need to just put it on paper. Um, nothing bad or negative, just full up brain. Oh, I had hypnotherapy last night as well again. And because my sleep's been so, so much better, we decided to like cover another area of my life, which was like creativity. And it's kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of like finding solutions to problems. So I've not, I've got, I've not got a problem. It's not a negative thing, but it's something within work where I'm stuck and I've got all of these ideas and so much I want to explore that I can't narrow it down. And I feel very, very hectic in my brain about it. And it's it's taken up a lot of space. Um, so we did a little bit of hypnotherapy. We had a big chat and then we did a bit of hypnotherapy around that, that is gonna, Gemma said it will settle in the next couple of days and it will, you know, it will help so much. So I'll, I'll keep reporting back on that for you as well. But honestly, like couldn't recommend her more. Like. She's just, yeah, I d wouldn't trust anybody else as a therapist or a hypnotherapy or anything that she does. She's an NLP practitioner and she supports be behavioral change and she's the sole responsibility for helping me figure out how to stop my anxiety and how to control it and manage it and for me to be in control of it and to understand it. So she just gave me all of the right tools for that. And I just, I could, yeah, I can't, I can't thank her enough. And we've been working together for years so yeah, um, I'll, I'll put the link on again for her. If you want to book like a, I think she does a complimentary discovery call and to figure out if you'd be right to work together and stuff. But yeah, so thankful for her. Um, right, I'm in a potter and I hope you're all having a lovely day and stuff, but obviously I'm gonna take you along to Paris. Um, and yeah. Guys, I got sent this amazing lamp from Atta Pinta, I think that's how you say it. And I'm obsessed with it, look at it. It's like a beautiful cloud. I am, honestly, it's beautiful. Let me turn it on for you. It has like a little dimmer as well. So it gently comes on. How beautiful is that? And it goes brighter or really soft. So I have it really soft at night time. It's so gorgeous. It's added so much like calm to my bedroom and I really do need to like iron my bedding does anyone else iron their bedding because I don't everybody from Paris just checked into a hotel we're staying at a hotel called the mob hotel um, Kim and I, she's about half an hour on the drag after me. As is with all Paris hotels, it's tiny, but really, really lovely. Like, done so well, so chic. And they upgraded our little room to a terrace. So like, come and have a look out here. And we're outside, we're over the gar overlooking the garden, so it's super quiet. Look, it's so nice. A gorgeous Paris evening, it's so humid. Oh my God, it's really, really warm actually. I have some amazing news that just got confirmed in the car on the way here. I am going to my first proper Paris Fashion Week show to see Victoria Beckham and I'm having a, fit, a, fit, a fitting appointment so I, I have to wear a look, Victoria Beckham look and then VB team are doing my makeup as well. So I just had a small overwhelmed tear in the car because I'm like, okay, this is mental. Um, so I'm really, really excited for that. It's going to be on Friday. So I'll obviously take you along to the fitting tomorrow and everything. And then, yeah, have my makeup done on the day of the show a couple of hours before. 
and I, as soon as it got confirmed I was like oh, what am I going to do with my hair and makeup and then they messaged and they were like do you want to come in for it I was like yes please <laughs> so I just need to worry about my hair now which I might just do like a slick back low bun or something so it's super chic but TBC guys TBC um yeah so I'm just waiting for Kim now I really desperately want a wine I want some food I'm gonna unpack because when Kim gets here honestly life won't be li worth living if she hasn't got enough space in the wardrobe so I just need to I'm just gonna take a, a small amount and then she can get all of her stuff out she's so organized and everything will be ironed to a crisp whereas my stuff is just not I don't operate in that way so I'm just gonna take a teeny weeny bit of space up and then she can go for a life and get organized um, but yeah, I'll take you along this evening. I don't know what we're going to do. The world's our oyster, isn't it? Um, just so happy to be here. Um, and I will... What's she saying? <laughs> she said her hair's grown about three times its usual size because of the humidity. What's going on? <laughs> Look who's here! Straight in the food. Straight in the food. Oh, what time? Yes. So I'm going to wear my own bottoms, but I'm going to wear this amazing, sorry I've got my knickers underneath, but I'm going to wear this amazing jacket that's like bonded wool and some VB sunglasses. And yeah, I'm going to put some really, either really baggy jeans on or, I don't know actually, yeah, I think really baggy jeans and a heel would be super chic, but I'm obsessed. Yeah, hi guys. Hi guys. From Paris. We... Bonjour. <laughs> Bonjour. Um, we have just been, God, what have we been up to? I've been to Victoria Beckham, which blew my mind. <laughs> and then I met him and we went to the Dior Risi, which is where you get to see the collection after the show's happened. And uh, that was really beautiful. And now we're walking to Sandro. It's very warm and I'm very hot. <laughs> I'm so glad we're in knitwear and leather. <laughs> knitwear and leather, great. I've not even showed you my outfit yet, I'm gonna show you in a bit. Very, very loud here. I'll take these off. Um, so I've got on a mango red fine knit. I've got a whistles trench, the brand new one the, for the it's the long one um, of the short one that I've already got of the bonded leather jacket. <laughs> and I've got some Deji Studios shorts on, which I love so so much. And then I also bought some Kate boots from Matches. And my Dior bag. And that's it. That's what I'm wearing today. I'm sweating. <laughs> Guys, I'm stressed. <laughs> I've got a little setup happening here <laughs> because <laughs> I'm trying, I'm, I'm gonna meet Hayley Bieber later and on the Kardashians too. And I, I can't get my glam right. So we've got Katie Jane Hughes on Kim's phone here. Yeah. Can I see it and show them? Thank you. Right, we're gonna, we're gonna copy Hayley Bieber's makeup to go and beat Hayley Bieber, okay? That's, yeah, that's good, right? <laughs> That's right, that was a mosquito show, was it? 
guys, I followed the tutorial from Katie Jane Hughes for Hayley Bieber makeup for me meeting Hayley Bieber. <laughs> I think it's gone okay. Yes! I don't yeah. look like Hayley Bieber though, <laughs> that's a shame. Beautiful. <laughs> You're better. I'm better. What's that? Oh, oh we've just... both got lots of palettes happening. I was just going to do a little swatch and I forgot them. <laughs> You're in your bra. <laughs> we're both in our bra. <laughs> Awful how <laughs> <laughs> We're so we were at the um we're at the terrace at the back of the bedroom, just trying to make this work. I need to do a lip. I need to do my hair. I I'm stressed. Hello guys, I did my hair and makeup myself. I don't know if you can really see it here. Maybe that's better. I did it all with the tutorial from Katie Jane Smith. I'm quite pleased with it. I think Kim had to help me out a little bit because there was some disjointedness happening. But I really like it, and I've done my hair like a little slick back bun and i'm gonna wear my acne studios dress with like black underwear underneath and a really high black gm vito rossi heel i'll show you properly later but the light's going so i just wanted to sh show you my makeup because i'm quite proud of it yeah guys the door just went and the um the parcel's here for victoria beckham for the show tomorrow so i'm just gonna do a little unboxing with you <laughs> this is my this is my invite just open it real quick. Don't know what that means, but that's my seat. <laughs> oh, it comes with. Whoa, cool. <gasps> nice. A little beautiful scarf. Okay. These are my sunglasses for the show tomorrow. So good. I hope it's sunny. <laughs> I'm wearing them whatever. Whatever. Ever. Let's see. I'm not going to get the clothes out right now. Okay. That's exciting though. Whee! <laughs> okay. Oh, yay! With Hello everyone. I thought you said you were ordering McDonald's. I am going to order McDonald's. It's in the door. It's steamy. It is steamy because it's sweaty. It's been hot. Hello everyone. I'm just coming home now into the hotel. I've got my shoes in my hand. My road goodie bag. She's got her shoes off as well. We're in agony. Good God. Bonsoir everybody. Is that what you say? Bonsoir. Good night. Yeah, well. Oh, hello. Bonsoir. Oh, it's really bright in here, isn't it? Anyway, guys, we just popped on to say hello. Oh, <laughs> we had a lot of coconut margaritas. And um, these are off. All the shoes are off. And um, that's it from us. We're going to get a McDonald's. Good night. This is number four. Yeah. So we'll say bonsoir from us. Is that what you even say? Because I can't, I can't, it's just not computing. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, it's a bit fun to sleep. Um, no, au revoir is bye. That's what bonsoir I think is good night or good evening. So bonsoir everybody. And then buenos noches, good night in Spanish. Yeah, in Spanish, but we're not in Spain. This is really misty, you're right. It's not great. It's just proper sweaty, isn't it? Give it a wipe. Right, good night everybody. Good night everybody. Have a great time and uh, I'm going to order a McDonald's and I'll see you tomorrow. We got the McDonald's. I'm so happy right now. Good morning everyone from Paris. Morning Kim. Morning. <laughs> 
We are very, very, very hungover. <gasps> and we did all the right things except from drink, didn't we? Yeah. We had a rehydration sachet. We took some charcoal supplements. We had a McDonald's. And yet here we are hanging. God, it's like half ten. Are you hungry? Yeah. I want a brew. I want a cup of tea, but I don't want a. I don't want a French cup of tea. I want a. I want a. Um. Yorkshire Gold cup of tea. I don't think we're gonna get that here. No. Oh God, she's sick of my shit this morning. She's not even replying to me. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I hope you're all really good. Today is gonna be long. Um. Oh, <laughs> But it's fine. It's Victoria Beckham show day today. So I am going to make myself have a miraculous recovery by two o'clock-ish. Because then I'm going to get my makeup done, ready for the show at 5.30. And in between that time, I'm going to have a cold shower to just help with it all. But it was worth it. It was such a fun night. It was so good. Um, both of our feet hurt. When Kim woke up this morning, she was like... What did you say? I feel like I was in a fight. Kim feels like she was in a fight last night. She's got painful legs from dancing and walking in heels. All oh. right, Nana. I know. Oh. I stretched and got cramped. <laughs> oh, guys. Right. Well, anyway, I'll catch up with you in a little bit when things are looking a little less bleak around here. Morning, guys, again. Um, I'm up and I'm ready. Uh, but very, very mousy this morning because I'm so tired. We're just going to get a coffee and a pastry. And then I'm going to head off to VB to get my makeup done, thank goodness. Uh, and then the show starts at like half five tonight. I've done my hair in a slip back bun because it's raining, which was not on the forecast. But otherwise, it's just going to be a nightmare with my curls and waves separating in the wind. And it's I'm going to feel horrible. So, yes. Well, I'm wearing my Whistles leather trench which is so good um a little reformation baby t-shirt really big levi's jeans and some mango red shoes um that are heavily inspired by the Mew Mew ones um and yeah we're gonna go out and get a coffee but i'll catch up with you in a bit this is sarah oh. I'm artist. she's amazing oh. she's bringing me back to life <laughs> done for Victoria Beckham with the Victoria Beckham makeup team and I feel very fancy and back to life. Yeah, I would never want to. Yeah, 
always so magical to be in those places. And like, we were sat outside and it was like gorgeous yeah. weather and yeah. it was and then I had, like I had an ambient. It was beautiful, wasn't it? And then I, thank God, bumped into this on the way into the show. I was on my own. They, when you walked in, they had. Yeah. And I nearly didn't walk in because the paparazzi and the scrum were away from us. I was like, I can't ask Brett to tell me what it's doing. She was just like, go, go, go. I was like, just own it because she looks amazing. Let me show them your outfit. Then you had just oh no, I haven't actually. I'll show you in a bit. Yeah. Like, yeah. like Lindsay looks amazing, and I was Whatever like, own it. Just go get your picture taken, and, and she did. Yeah, 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 I did. I did. It was good. Yeah, I'm just so glad to get in and out of there. But like, my gosh, yeah, it was amazing. Everyone was like, Victoria, 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 Victoria. and I was like, what? Yeah. Oh Crazy. It's absolutely crazy. It's so it's crazy. There were so many like huge celebrities there. There were like, yeah, like Kim Kardashian was there. We didn't yeah. see her. We didn't see her. Yeah. She was around. Yeah. And then she was great. Kendall, Kendall wore like, really clothes the show. Yeah, she looked incredible. She looked amazing. Really like slicked back, massive glasses. So the security is clamping down on it. It was really amazing. And I was like, all right, okay, no worries. I'll just sleep and everything else leaves. We're going to get to the VP party, but first we have some wine. And I was like, I'm going to stay. Do you know what? I can't wait. Bye, guys. Good morning from some very tired people in Paris. We had another late night last night. But it was so much fun. Went to the Victoria Beckham party. And it was wild. Like... I really just didn't do my eyebrows well, Kim, this morning. Look how dark they are. I don't do it anymore. <laughs> I've got to go out in public now. I can't even see. Um, anyway, it was such a fun party. It was so, so good. We had to put little stickers on the backs of our phones. We weren't allowed to take any pictures or videos or anything. Because people like Leonardo DiCaprio, Kim Kardashian, obviously all the Beckhams, were all there. It was mad. Me and Kim just spent the whole night going... <laughs> it was mental. But so much fun. Well, I had lots of lo fun, oh yeah, we had lots and lots of dancing again. And now we're going out. We're going to go vintage shopping today. I'm going to meet my friend Nadia. Um, so we're having quite a chilled day, aren't we? We're just going to get some breakfast, have a coffee, um, and yeah, meet Nads. I go shopping and then meet some of the friends later. We're going to go for dinner. And then we've got a reformation party tonight and then we are out of here tomorrow because neither of us can take any more. <laughs> it's been <laughs> the best eyes. time. I know, I'm like, it's been the best, best time, but also Kim and I aren't very party, are we? And we've no. really had to like dig deep. We've had a lot of espresso martinis to get us to this point, haven't we? But yeah, anyway, I'll catch up with you in a bit and I hope you're all good. <laughs> Yeah, that is cool. Hello guys, we're just having a little coffee break and a wee break. We've done some vintage shopping and we're going to carry on vintage shopping because I've not yet found what I wanted, even though I don't know really what I want. Um, and we've picked up some friends along the way. So we've been in and out of people all day, it's been great. Um, and it's beautiful weather in Paris. I'm feeling more awake now, which is so nice. I was just stressing over when I'm going to get time to edit this vlog for you, but it might just be... I mean, I'm telling you this now, but you're not going to see it till you see it. So anyway, it's going to be late, so I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to carry on vintage shopping and I'm going to meet some friends for a drink, then go back, get ready for dinner and then a party with Reformation this evening. <laughs> Kim literally, I just let on my... <laughs> let on my shoulder. <laughs> I thought of another party. <laughs> Hello everybody, we are ready for our final night out in Paris and out of nowhere I do seem to have some more energy but I, it's not going to stay for long. Um, so I did my hair and makeup myself, um, there was no glam team today, <laughs> I'm just wearing a very glowy look with uh, the new Hailey Bieber lip peptide, the lip tint in like the espresso colour in the cocoa, is it espresso or cocoa? Anyway it's brown um, and I've got a Victoria Beckham lip liner on with it too. Um, wearing wise, I've just got a Reformation little tank on to be comfy, really long baggy jeans and some um, Diamante heels and my Diamante bag from Whistles. So yeah, going for dinner and then we're going to a Reformation party. 
and it's going to be lovely. We're just trying to really rally around for the third and final time and then we can go home tomorrow after the most fun week ever. Uh, so I'll take you along where I can this evening but yeah I'm going to wrap it up so that I can get the vlog up in time and everything for you on su Sunday. Um, but yeah I hope you're all really good and that you've had a lovely week and weekend and stuff. Um, yeah I'll vlog a little bit from this evening and then I'll say bye to you later. Hello guys, we are back from our evening out. Makeup off, face mask on. Can't wait to get in bed, we're just doing a bit of packing. We leave tomorrow and it's been the best girls trip ever. Girls slash work trip ever. Um, <laughs> Kim just peeped out being like, I haven't done no work. <laughs> no, but I'm, I'm just going to come across my piss and brown. So, <laughs> cameo on the vlog. Cameo in your undies. Um, but yes, it's been the most amazing week this week. I've been very, very lucky and had such a gorgeous time. And I'm going to go to bed. That's what I'm going to do. So I hope you really enjoy this week's vlog. I hope you're all really good and that you've had a lovely week and weekend too. And thank you, as always, so much for watching. And I'll see you next week. <laughs>